So yeah, guys, it's freedom. It's all about freedom. Hey, guys. Okay, guys, this is part two of the series. New My Protein Freedom Flavors. Yesterday, we reviewed the French Toast. If you missed that one, you can definitely check down the video below. The link is going to be below. Go check it out. It was actually very good. Now, today we're going to do glazed donut. Glazed donut. So, just a quick reminder. All these flavors are supposed to be like all-American type flavors. So, we have uh, Boston cream pie coming. Glazed donut, obviously, today. Snickerdoodle. Um... French toast, which is obviously very American, and a couple of others. Anyway, long story short, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this one, I'm going to shake it, I'm going to mix it, I'm going to tell you three things. How it mixes, how does it taste, independent of the fact of does it taste like a glazed donut or not, and then I'm going to tell you does it actually taste like a glazed donut, and then we're going to wrap this thing up. Sounds like a plan. Okay, so let's do it, guys. Refresher. This is the size of the scoop. We're going to put it in... 12 ounces of water. In my first review, some people were worried that there was too much water. So this time I actually measured. <laughs> 12 ounces. Okay, glazed donut. Let's see what happens. So as far as mixability, so there's a bit of foam on the top. You see that? See that? Okay, so how does it mix? It mixed quite well. It mixed well. As far as the taste, let me let me try another one because the first one wasn't that good. No, I, I'm not sure I like this actually, the glazed donut. It's it's sweet. It doesn't I don't think it tastes like a glazed donut. Like the only glazed donut I can compare to is the OEA one bar. Glazed donut, which is freaking amazing and super sweet. This is not super sweet, and there's sort of, sort of, um, almost like a chalky aftertaste. Yeah, it tastes okay when you take it in, but there is a bit of a chalky aftertaste. I would say this: as far as mixability. Nine and a half out of ten, it's probably a bit less. The mixability yesterday with the French toast was brilliant. This is very good, so I would say nine and a half out of ten. As far as the actual taste, I would have to go with a seven and a half, eight out of ten because of the aftertaste. A bit of an aftertaste, so seven and a half out of ten. As far as the, does it actually taste like a glazed donut? I don't think so. Listen, this is it. This is part two. Check out part one. Another one coming soon, another flavor. If this video was helpful in your glazed donut making decision process, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel to see more reviews, and if you want to compare prices, find the best deals on anything fitness, supplements, shoes, whatever, 